The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Zan Pauli facing Barcelona. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? Well timed tackle. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Promising move from Barcelona. This looks interesting. They've won back possession. Frankie de Jong. And he might be through here. In it goes! But wait a minute, that will not count. Well, that was tight, but he was just offside. It was a good finish, though. Kamavinga. Ryan Grafenberg. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Oh, yes! First to score in this final. And it could be high. Well, here's the replay. The pass over the top has just the right amount of pace on it. And then just look at the finish, Derek. He reads the flight perfectly and absolutely smashes it beyond the goalkeeper. There's just no stopping that. And Barca get the ball moving once more. How will they react? to get tighter here could be still possibilities well that's the end of that for now and he's found a bit of daylight well the attack the defender put in the challenge and it might be a red card and I think that's one we could have called from five miles away, Stuart. Clear red card offence. Well, you've obviously got very good eyesight, but no doubt about that. He stopped a goal-scoring opportunity there. He had to go. I had my eyes tested. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, let's see this again, because that's a fantastic bit of technique. To get that much movement and accuracy on the strike needs the perfect contact on the ball. And he's certainly got that. What a free kick that is. Well, a second goal for them here. Excellent defending. De Jong just looking for the right moment for that final pass now what can they do from here De Jong and there it is still life left in this game and they have the momentum now well let's look at the replay they move the ball so well just waiting for an opening and the movement is good making for a comfortable finish it's a really great goal so back underway here, and Barca within touching distance. Grafenberg. Now he must favour the cross. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. He has very much been the talk of the town going into this match. 
Facing his former club, facing his past. And that's not always straightforward, is it, Stuart? Well, it can work either way. Some players are inspired and play really well. Some feel overawed. I hope for his sake it's the first. Ryan Grafenberg. Can they convert? In it goes! That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. And a throw-in it's going to be. Josko Gvardiol. Kamavinga firing it towards goal. Superb stop. Short corner it is. Has a go. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, those stats back up what we've been watching. It's been a really one-sided game. And it's far too easy for them to open up this defence. This could turn into a rout. On the ball, Hernandez. De Jong. It is a decent-looking attack here. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. And taken short. Cuts it back. Could be. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Well, neutrals are getting their money's worth. 3-2 in this match. And here now is Hernandez. Frankie de Jong. Ishan Boudin. Options in the middle. He takes aim, putting his body on the line. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Ijem Boudaoui. An encouraging move from Barca. Oh, it might be! Capable of so much better from that position. Eduardo Camavinga. Kamavinga Karim Adeyemi and that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger and short it is having won the ball back they might be able to profit top class defending And here now is Hernandez. Oh, nice ball. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. It's opening up for them. And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. And the short option preferred. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Oh, in for the chance! And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and just look at these fans! The trophy coming their way, surely! Well, 
Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Well, we're into the final half hour. Hernandez. Getting the better of his opponent. De Jong. Oh, a vital interception. In with a chance. Surely. And a goal to increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, but in the end, it's far too easy to create the 2v1 against the keeper. What were the defenders trying to do? Nice finish, but poor defensively. Hernandez. De Jong. The cross is on. On to Hernandez. Frankie de Jong. Firing is in. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Corner kick played in. And the danger's still on. And I think the threat has been averted. And they've won the ball back following that challenge. And pushed away to safety. Well, I still can't believe that didn't go in, Derek. It's a fantastic stop from the keeper, you have to say. Simakon. Adeyemi. Baku. And it's played into the centre. It might still be problematic. It should be! And a decent save, full credit. Can he make it count? Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Going short. And he takes it on. And the referee has given them a corner. Playing it short. Can he put it in? Marvellous anticipation. Cup Mainers. Kimpembe. It's with Cup Mainers. And he did well to cut it out. Oh, that's a really good run. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Oh, lovely ball. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish, but the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me.
Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. Frankie de Jong. And he's through here. And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing! Just can't stop him today! Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. And there it is! Full time! They are the Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Here we go, the Champions League winners. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.